Hi, welcome back to my channel. My name is Laura. I'm filming in the middle of the night because I woke up and after I filmed my Cheek Sparrow collection, I realized that I missed three notebooks and I missed my totes. So yes, I still have more Cheek Sparrow stuff that I didn't show to you. Uh, so I'm going to share that today. <clears throat> okay, so um, I didn't realize it until I went to do my daily pages and I was like, wait a minute, I didn't share this notebook. So I'm going to share that. I have three B6s that I didn't share. One was upstairs. Uh, one was my, um, my daily um, morning pages. And the other one just holds notebooks. Um, so here are my three B6s. So the first one is my daily pages. Um, I started in December um, writing every day, the good, the bad, the ugly, um, everything is in here. This is a journal where I don't want anybody to read. I'm sure once I die, they can read it, but um, for right now, I put everything in here. If my kids annoy me, um, if I have problems with my husband, I write everything down. I used to have a journal where I wrote all the bad and it was a journal that was just bad. But now since I did the artist way, she wants us to write down a brain dump uh, every day. So I started in December and what the book I'm using is a B6 uh, Misty Mountain. Um, and I have inserts in here from Walmart. Um, so. Let me just share it. I'm not going to show you my journaling, but I have these notebooks in here. Well, first I have my pictures of my kids uh, and my family. And there's my husband in there. Um, and then I have my dog and me and my husband. Uh, but these notebooks I got from Walmart and they are great for brain dumps. Um, they're um, like $3 a book. I have one, two, three, four books in here. I've used the first one, this one here. Um, see, they're from um, they're from Walmart. So they're Pure Gear Junior Composition book. So they are like three dollars a book. They don't lie flat. That's the only thing. Um, I have to use my cell phone or a pair of scissors uh, to lay the book flat while I'm writing. Uh, but uh, they're great because they're like junk journals type thing. Um, I, I use my fountain pen. Um, and it doesn't bleed through. This is the fountain pen I Lamy uh, that I use in here. Um, and uh, the very first book is my December one which you I try to write every day um, and uh, it's just a brain dump just to get um, things off my mind and like anything like I even jot down I have to pay a bill or I have to go to the dentist or anything uh, that I just want to write down and remember later on I don't read them um, Artist Way says not to read them, but uh, later in our journal sh uh, journey, she will uh, make us go back and read them. So, yeah, so that is what I'm using this book for. And, the, and again, this is a Misty Mountain. And my, look, I just got my nails done, so they kind of match. Uh, it's my favorite color. So this is Misty Mountain. Uh, it's the new Waypoint um, leather. So, yes, and it's a B6 size. Okay, the second B6 that I am using is my Kindle, and I didn't realize it that, um, this is, um, I realized that I didn't put it in the video because it was upstairs, because I read upstairs, I don't read in my office, so, um, I have a, uh, Outlander Prince, this is a B6, um, this is where my Kindle is housed. Um, I have a insert, uh, from Foxy Fix in here, and I have a, another composition notebook from Walmart in here, and I have my Kindle, so, um, I'm gonna share, um, and this is Prince, the color purple, um, and, uh, here is the Foxy Fix, um, insert. I got this from Foxy Fix. Um, 
and it's pink um, and it's just an insert um, and then it's wrapped around my composition notebook and in this composition notebook I have a list of books I have on my Kindle and I printed it out I have it all on my Goodreads uh, I just lost my pen but uh, I have it all on my Goodreads so I printed it out and um, my goal is to try to read these um, on my Kindle. I, I don't like my Kindle, as I said before. Um, I rather read a physical book, um, but uh, I have a Kindle and I have tons and tons of books on my Kindle and I printed every one out that I own and I plan to one day start reading these things. So I have a lot, so look at that. I have a lot of books in there. I also joined uh, Kindle Unlimited for 99 cents for three months, again. And we'll see if I get to use it. So um, it's a mo motivational to use. Look how many books I have, geez. I have a lot of books on this Kindle. So, okay, so in the, this is the insert wrapped around. Uh, and here is my Kindle. I have it on the last string. Um, yep, I have it on the last string. The string is here. Now, when I read, I take it out of here. Uh, but when I am storing it, it goes back in my book. And um, I bring this along with me if I want to read. So that's the second one. I lost my pen. It fell on the floor. But anyway... It wasn't a Lamy or anything. Uh, the third uh, uh, notebook is a B6 as well. It is a buttered rum. Um, and this one is just holding notebooks. I think it's just the Walmart notebooks are in here. Let me check. Uh, I haven't written in this one. It's just the Walmart notebooks. See how they're all different colors? It's pretty cool. So they store nicely. This one, I only have three in here. They actually do fit four, but I have three inserts. So, yeah, so that's that one. Okay, other Cheek Sparrow stuff that I own. Um, I own an extra small pocket, um, and this thing is very tiny. It is a Misty Mountain. I love the color. Uh, Misty Mountain, this is extra small. Uh, it doesn't really hold much. Um, I actually got it to put change in because it's really, really tiny. It doesn't hold in. It's smaller than the Nano. It's very tiny. However, what I have in here is my strap. So when I ordered these, it gives you an option to buy a strap. And I figured okay let me get the strap because i thought maybe i could clip it onto here and use it as a pocketbook but the strap does not really work on these things i don't know why but i have a misty mountain strap yep the same color as my misty mountain so i need into in 2020 get something to use this for um yeah I don't know why they sold this to me. It should not have been an option to buy. Um, yeah, when I was ordering this, it prompted me to add a strap or not. So, yeah. Anyway, so I have a strap, Misty Mountain, my favorite color, but what the heck am I using this for? Nothing right now. It's actually stored in my little pouch. Um, so at least I could find it. The last two items of Cheek Sparrow that I own are two totes. I got these off the buy, sell, trade list. Um, yeah, so I paid cheaper. The, I'm the second owner to both of these. Um, and um, I did pay cheaper than the Cheek Sparrow website. But they are used and they have some damage on them. Uh, but I still um, am using them every day so the first one is a black and she doesn't sell black anymore so i was really happy to find this on the buy sell tray list this is a breezy tote um and here is the black um i got a breezy tote it is small um it holds like two 
um, notebooks to, um, what do you call it? To, um, hardcover notebooks from, you know, regular library books. Um, and it's small. It has a pocket on the front and mine has a little bit of damage. I have, um, some pen damage over here. If you can see it, there's two little pen damages, but, um, I didn't mind that. I bought it cheaper than what Cheek Sparrow sells and she does not sell the black anymore. And black, you really need a black tote. So, um, what I have in here right now is my Misty Mountain wallet. This is this one. And my everyday carry. Actually, this one's my wallet. This is the small. Uh, <clears throat> uh, this is Misty Mountain. This has my wallet. And the other one has my everyday carry. This is the medium. So that's what I have stored in here. And I carry it up and down or if I'm going out shopping. So it fits really nicely in there. Um, I also usually have my book in there. Uh, but I must have took it out because I was upstairs. I just carried everything down. Uh, but I love this Breezy Toad. It's really small, compact. It does fit a lot. Um, and just to carry those three items. I usually have a book in there too. Um, and in the front, it has a pocket to put your cell phone. Um, or I usually put my, um, in the front, uh, a protein bar when I'm running around. So, yeah. So that's that one. And then I have a rustic tote. And the rustic tote is very, very big compared to that one. Um, I have a, I think it's a quiet tan. Um, and again, I got it used, uh, so it does have a lot of damage on it. Um, here is my used tote. It came with the line, she said. Uh, you see that black line? It came like that from Cheek Sparrow, uh, but it has a lot of wear and tear on it. Um, but I do love it. It's bigger. You could fit a lot of stuff in here. Um, yeah. What do I have in there now? I don't even know. Okay. Um, I have in here now my 2019 um, Weeks Weekly Cover. This is the 2019 Hobo Weeks Mega. And um, I shove it in the very, t the very pocket, the very pocket at the end. So that's what I have there. And then on the other side, there's another pocket, and I have my um, 2020 um, weeks. So that's this and on the other side. Okay, so I have a book that I'm currently reading, which is uh, Comfort and Joy by Kristen Hanna. So that's sitting in there. I need to finish this. I'm halfway through. Um, halfway through that. And um, I have my sunglasses. These are great. I got these at Old Navy for like $2 on clearance. I think they're like 4 or $5. And they hold pens too, but I have my sunglasses in here. These are my prescription sunglasses, so they're in there. Um, and then I have my Christmas journal is in here, and I have it in a pouch that I made. Um, and I have, see, here is the pens. This is, I got from Old Navy. It's a um, eyeglass holder and I put my pens in there. So I have some highlighters and I have some regular pens in different colors in there. I have my pen because I watercolor sometimes. I have my Micron. This is water uh, resistant, waterproof. Um, and this is what I draw with. Um, and then I watercolor it. Um, I have a fountain pen in here that I got at Michael's really purple. This is a fountain pen. This is what, what's the make? A zebra fountain pen. I got this really cheap. I think they sell them for like three bucks or something like that. Uh, yeah, but I really love this pen. It's, it writes in purple. Yeah, it's a fountain pen. Um, and Michael's has them. They sell them in different colors. 
Um, I have a green pen. This, these are my favorite as well. And this is called a touch pen. Um, I think that's what it says. It doesn't say it's touch, but it writes sparkly. It's really cool. It's like a felt tip pen. It's felt tip pen like that. And it writes really, really nice. Let me see if I can get something to write on. Do I have any piece of paper? Uh, I'm just gonna grab a scrap. All right, so here's my scrap piece of paper. I'm gonna write on it. Um, uh, it writes really, really sparkly. So here you go. Look at that. Sparkly. I really like how it, it's like a fountain pen and it writes dark and light. I have it in green and I think I have a purple one in there. I don't know. No, I don't think so. I have, oh, I have a different pen in here. I have a Pentel Sparkle Pop uh, and it's in purple and I got this at Michael's so I'm not even going to write with it. <clears throat> Hello, all right, YouTube. Okay, here's the sparkly purple pen. Hello, YouTube. So, yeah. So that looks really cool. It's sparkly. This is my favorite. Um, you buy these individual at Michael's. They have this really great section in my Michael's. They changed it where you could buy individual pens. And sometimes they have buy two, get one free. Uh, which is really cool. And then I have my regular V5 Precise Pilot, my favorite pen, because they write really, really thin. Um, and so that's what I carry in this. And then I have my Christmas journal that I'm carrying around in this big tote. Uh, this is Christmas Hanukkah. Actually, I got to write in this thing because we're on day three and I didn't journal in here yet. So I am going to be doing that now. Uh, anyway, have a great day. Um, I'm sorry I missed my three B6s in my last video, but I hope I gave you some ideas to use your B6s and to use your totes. So thank you for watching. Have a great week, and I will see you in another video. Bye.